are, 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 they, <laughs> are they an endangered species? I always have to ask that. You can see why now, can't you? Wait a minute. Easy. You can see why now, can't you? Wait a minute. He's bitten me. He pulled off my hand. Okay. Wait a minute, let's... Lord, behave yourself. Let's... Okay, now, would you stop? No. Oh, down, boy. All right, let's try again. Can you take him over there, honey, please? Why should I? A classic moment in television brought to you by the legendary Fred Griffith. What made Fred a legend, an icon in broadcast TV? Well, what you saw there, the natural delivery, just the fun and the spontaneity that Fred had. But remember, Fred basically invented the morning talk show format. He sat a couple of co-hosts down next to him on a couch, and they just started talking about their day. They were real. They connected with you even before the word connection was ever associated with television and the viewer. And Fred's style, his mannerisms were often duplicated, but never as effective as Fred Griffith did it. Right, Danita Harris? Yeah, that's right. All right. And the format for Good Morning America was based off Fred and uh, the morning exchange. I had the privilege of working on that show for about 15 years. It was an honor. And Fred Griffith was exactly the person you saw on TV in real life. He was the guy you wanted to sit across from at the breakfast table and share coffee with and a story. And that was the secret to Fred Griffith. He was real, he was genuine, he was honest, and he was kind. He'd give you the shirt off his back any day. Up until the day he passed away, he would do that. We miss Fred, we love Fred. He is a legend and he's part of what made News 5 the great television legacy that it is today. We'll be right back.